In this video, we're reviewing Jameson Irish Whiskey. Irish, they certainly know how to make a, a great whiskey. Jameson is undisputably the king of Irish whiskey. But there is one small problem with that. John Jameson was technically Scottish. Blasphemy! Back in the 1700s, Irish whiskey was dominated by one powerful family, divided into two branches, the Hags and the Steins. And John Jameson, as I said, Scottish. Oh, blasphemy! Married into the Hag family. Alexander Hag? Sorry. John Jameson was put in charge of the Bow Distillery in 1777. It went really well, and then in 1810, he took over the distillery and made the John Jameson brand. And now it is the number one selling Irish whiskey in the world, selling over 56 million bottles a year. And I'm not so much of a whiskey snob that I don't want to try it. Jameson is a pale gold color. It's really nice. And all of the grain that goes into this whiskey comes from a 50 mile radius of the distillery, which is in cork. And that means absolutely nothing for the color. But it's a cool fact. It's like a fun fact. Maybe a bit earthy, but for the most part, I really only pick up those strong ethanol alcohol smells. To me, on the palate, I, I don't really get very much. Yes, it's very, it's very pure. I'll give them that. I just don't get a lot of other flavors. It's not harsh. It's not difficult to drink. But if I were to sit here and try to tell you what it tastes of, I'm going to struggle because I can't really pick out many individual specific tastes. I can tell you that it's well integrated. I can tell you it's light bodied, but I don't know if I could really say this tastes like anything. It's pleasant. It just doesn't have a really strong flavor to it. I haven't just tried it. I totally agree with you. If you handed me that blindfold and said, this is warm tequila or warm vodka, I'd believe you. Well, you're an idiot. I know, but I trust you. Have you had whiskey before? The finish is short, sharp, but actually I think that's my favorite part. I almost get a bit of herbal flavors coming through. And I think that's my problem with this whiskey. I think the nose puts me off. The palate doesn't offer me very much and the finish is good. But if I drink this neat, that's not the experience that I want when I'm drinking whiskey. I want to enjoy the whole spectrum. I don't want it to just have a nice happy ending. Um, phrasing? Let us know what you think of Jameson by clicking the eye above my head uh, and voting. I'd be interested to see what you think of Jameson. What do you think? As a base spirit for a cocktail, it's fantastic. It's great and old fashioned. It's really nice if you do a whiskey and soda, but neat? It's not something I really enjoy. Jameson is an acceptable whiskey. For more whiskey reviews, subscribe to our channel. Just click the subscribe button. We do a new video every week. I did bring up a Coke to mix with.